everyone and welcome back to my channel so this is a bit of a weird setup isn't it so i thought that i would do a vlog because look, i absolutely love watching vlogs um and i've wanted to do a vlog for ages but i just feel like i don't really have the confidence to do one so i thought you know what today i'm gonna do a little like i don't know it's not really a weekend vlog it's sunday today but it's gonna be like a little vlog i don't know if all, it'll all be like today or you know whatever i'm just gonna chuck it all together whatever i film anyway but yeah i thought that i'd do a vlog so i thought i'd just start off just by doing my makeup for today and yeah just having a little chat um i'm trying to be a little bit quiet because child is just in the next room sleeping um and I definitely don't want to wake her up because this morning oof, let's just say she woke up like six ish she's been non-stop this morning so um she's like teething again like her top teeth are, are coming through like she's biting everything everything's just always soaking wet like hopefully she sleeps for a little while and yeah can she get a bit of energy back from this morning from all the rolling around she's doing honestly she's rolling everywhere at the minute like oh, it's mad it is mad the development in babies she bought a split boot bender about uh, just four holidays i think about just over oh, three weeks ago um and i oh, really needed one honestly i just i bought a foundation brush as well um because i thought i'd like use that instead and just use the beauty blender so i've just wetted on my hands like <laughs> and um, and i thought i'd use the beauty blender just just to like um do my concealer but i actually just didn't like the foundation brush i feel like it takes up so like, it takes away quite a lot of my foundation um so i'm much for a beauty blender I've got a bit of a new recall that I'm going to um, try and do after this if Jayla is still fast asleep. Um, so I am going to try and do that because um, I've got some, oh, I'm really excited, I've got some really cute bits in there to show you. Um, and in a couple of weeks we go on like on a little day trip, um, like me, my mum, my two brothers, um, brother's girlfriend, uh, me, my fiance and obviously Jayla as well. Um, yeah, we're going on like a little day trip and I really wanted to like find something that was like comfy for like a long journey. Um, and then like, obviously comfy to like walk around um, and things like that. So yeah, I've bought some really cute bits and I'm really excited. And I know it's so silly, but I've also bought Jayla an outfit. Not like she needs any more outfits, she does not. But I've just popped on a little bit of the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer just under my eyes and then on my forehead as well. So I'm just blending that in. The, we've got the shopping coming. Um, the, um, we shop with Tesco and I'm just getting like an online delivery. So we've got that coming soon. Um, we're always at the last stop though, so it'll probably be like around 10 ish. So we've got that coming and then I'm going to visit my nan today, which obviously I'm not going to film. Um, but yeah, I'm going to see her and obviously take Jayla with me so she can see her as well. not really sure what I think. I really want to pop to like home bargains like B&M because I feel like I've not been for one for quite a while. For that to latch, I did actually pop to a B&M um, recently and I, I didn't really have a really good look around because... I just feel like sometimes you can just get really carried away in there. But um, I do want to have just like a little look um, in there and not home bargains as well. So I think maybe we might do that today. I feel like I lack confidence in doing, in doing vlogs as well. Just because I just... <laughs> oh, tell me if I'm wrong, right? but on YouTube, I feel like when you watch it, people are like doing like these big house renovations and like they have these massive houses and... Like they have like five bedrooms and yeah, they're just like I don't know. Like I feel like a lot of times renovation vlogs and things or like there's home updates. And I think I literally like I moved in last year and like we only have like one room left apparently, which is our bedroom, but we've not got around to it just because Jada still sleeps in the bedroom, so I'm a bit wary of like painting and things with her being in there. So. We've just left it. I'm just like, you know what? I'm not really that bothered because we've obviously had, we had to like move the bed across as well just to fit the cotton and things like that. So um, I thought we'll just wait because it's, it's a lot of hassle to keep moving her cotton and moving everything and painting and stuff. So we did the wallpapering on the back wall, but then we 
left everything else like by the way this brush is absolutely battered so but i i am upset it's just such a big fluffy brush i think it's from not super drug like years ago um and yeah it's so old and like horrible but i'm just obsessed with it i think it's really good for doing this and i feel like i look quite orange on this side but it's because the window's right there but it actually looks quite nice i promise <laughs> <laughs> um yeah look every yeah but yeah i'm saying like everyone does such big house renovations or always buying things for the house and things and i'm just like yeah my house looks nothing like that and i absolutely love my house so you know i do yeah i absolutely love my house Um, i love how it looks it's just it's just like i feel like Sometimes when you watch vlogs, you can't really like relate to things as much. So that was the, uh, I can't even say that, but that was the NYX matte bronzer that I've just used around my face. Um, and then I'm just wondering, this may be in Tattoo Brow Styling Gel, which I think um, it is quite good. It's meant to last on, on your eyebrows for up to three days, but I don't really think it does. Um, to be honest, it's gone down quite a lot now, so it's not as dark as what it used to be. But I just kind of just brush it through my brows. Um, just so it's like using a pencil really because it does I do like this because it does last a lot longer than um, like using like a pencil and things like that but you do have to be careful when you first buy it that you don't like bring like loads of product out and put it on your eyebrow because it can get quite it can get quite messy but as you can see like the difference that one's a little bit darker than that one so um, I do really like this product I started using it uh, about a month and a half ago and I do really enjoy using it so it's hard to do makeup in here because the light like my windows up there so this side looks different to this side but I've got a mirror in front of me so I can see that it looks okay um it's good as it's getting today because I'm, I'm really like I'm not really like so I'm not really doing much today um so Sometimes I'll just do really quick makeup. This sometimes can just take about like ten minutes. I'm good for the day. Um, next I'm using the NYX the brow glue. Um, and I'm just gonna just go over that a little bit of blusher, and then I will do my lipstick just because I am trying on that. Um, I'm trying on the clothes that I got from New Look. But usually I don't do this until we go out. I've got a lip liner, but I don't think I'm gonna bother today to be honest I feel like if you don't add a lip liner you feel like you're just not as done up like you feel like it's a little bit like a little bit like not done what's the word like makeup obviously not dressed down not so done up <laughs> not so done up then um you just feel like you're not so done up when you don't wear a lip, if you wear a lip liner so yeah I'm not gonna put a lip liner on today this was the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. These are my favourite. This is practically all I use. Um, I love this colour. It's, I think it's called Toulouse. It's so like the, the camera's this side. And I like you putting it that side because usually it's that side. So it's, sorry about that. It's not going to focus, is it? <laughs> I feel like I see YouTube is doing this. I'm like, uh yeah she's not gonna focus today but yeah i think it's called toulouse so focus focus no i'm not focusing so i've just quickly brushed my hair and then i'm just gonna go and get the new look parcel and i'm gonna try the clothes on from that and obviously just um, show you when i do it i think i might use the mirror um and I'll just show you in the mirror of me trying them on. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go into that now. Yeah, but I've just give my hair a quick brush. At the minute, my hair we have like a love hair relationship. Like, can you see how it sticks up? It's basically like under here. There's like baby hair. I'm not when well, it's not even baby hair. Sorry, it's uh, postpartum hair. I'd say <laughs> from having a baby. Um, and yeah, like you just it's it's honestly it doesn't look that bad here. But when I put my hair up in like a ponytail or Born. oh my gosh it stinks so <laughs> it looks so oh my god it just looks so funny um it's honestly wild it really is and the thing is it's the same like hair that's broke off it literally just like it's just grown and like even here can you see like these look at that i know if you've had them before but then it's just like okay long that is 
it's honestly it's wild it's just it's oh, i don't know it's just growing mad at the minute so yeah I, if i put my hair in like a bun or something i usually spend like five minutes on wet, wet the comb i'm pushing it down then i get the hair spur on it and do that and sometimes it still sticks up but i'm not really a big fan of like using gel things like that so okay i'm gonna go stop rambling now because honestly i've been standing here for ages talking and yeah <laughs> I feel like I've just been nattering for ages and look at the thing and we're nearly on half an hour we're nearly on half an hour I didn't think I'd be in the bathroom this long talking to the camera for half an hour but there we go at this rate I'll be doing a try on half hour for him Tesco will show up and I'll be off dressed and I'm trying to run around then just to chuck some clothes on so I can go downstairs into the shopping um so yeah um but looking now my fiance gets the door and then I'll, I'll wait in the kitchen and then he comes with the baskets so I'm like get it all out so i went to quickly do the try on i put the first dress on and what did i say when i was filming just i literally said i bet i'll try the clothes on and tesco will turn up tesco will have turned up so um let's knock at the door like i like just said tesco has just been um that was so typical i literally tried the first dress on and i went to go in the mirror and film and i heard the car pull up and then jason went uh, Tesco was here and I thought I knew it. I just knew as soon as I got changed, Tesco would appear. <laughs> and I think they're quite early actually today. I, I, I don't even know what time it is, but I think they're actually quite early. So it really makes a change because usually we always like the last one. So I'll just give you like, just a quick pan of our shopping of what we've got this week. Um, and yeah, then I'm going to put it away and then I will do the new look try and haul. This is just our shopping for the week. It actually, oh my gosh, it looks like loads, doesn't it? Um, but honestly, I feel like shopping, like what you buy, is just quite expensive. But I suppose it all depends on like, you know, the brands and things you buy. I mean, this isn't actually for me. I've never seen this before. I didn't even know they did this. That's quite cool though, isn't it? Um, but yeah, we've got some strawberries. Janet loves, loves, loves strawberries. She's just obsessed with them. Um, then I'll, I'll cheese. I feel like we go through quite a lot of cheese. We've got jack potatoes, um, onions, some nor potatoes, broccoli, lots of salad things because we do go through a bit of salad. Big pack of chickens, pepperoni. Um, there's some more stuff under there and some wraps and things. Bagels, crisps, um, butter. Um, like wash for Jayla. Um, bought these actually. I know they had this one, the sweet chili jam, but my fiance actually bought this one. Um, I think my fiance, I should say Jason. Um, yeah, but he got this one, Perry barbecue sauce. I've never actually seen that one before. Um, so yeah, he picked that up and then she's picked up some like, beans, um, got some bickies. Yogurt, so basically I eat these yogurts and then I also buy these for Jayla because they're now added sugar and they're good to put in the freezer and things like in one of those dummies and I've got a cucumber and then I also, I basically cook all her meals but I buy, um, what are these called, fruit pouches, yeah, so I buy just like fruit pouches because these are really good to like um, pop in like the oyster mould, so I've got an oyster mould and I pop these in, pop them in the freezer, just while it's warm. Um, I also buy a lot of things, I buy a lot of things like it's actually, like the baby stuff, like these are the wafers. Um, and then I've got these as well, which are like the strawberry and banana melty puffs. She has got lowered, so basically we've got this whole worktop here and then obviously it goes round and then round the back of me, which is like the um, fridge freezer. But then I also have the on another, another section, which is like probably like as big as this to this side of the cooker is, and that's just Jayla's stuff. It's her sterilizers on there, her bottles, her milk, her food, like um, any like things like the beakers, the um, flats, and everything like that. So yeah, but I'm just gonna pop all this away now, and then like I said, I'll do the try and haul. So I've just had to move the mirror because it was quite dark over there and I thought like you just couldn't see it properly so I've just moved it um, and I feel like this just works a little bit better. So this is the first dress and it's absolutely stunning. So as you can see it's like um, small flowers here, 
and obviously it's on the bigger flowers of this side and then it's just a full length and it's got like a little split in here which i really like because it actually just it look it doesn't come all the way up to here it just comes to my knee so i really like that then as you can see the bottom as well is like a very small floral print and this is all big here it's got puffy sleeves it's got a small little tie here which i think is just absolutely gorgeous but i'm sorry how beautiful is this dress it's absolutely stunning i'm really obsessed with it i think it's gorgeous and you know what i didn't even think i'd like it this much but i do so yeah i definitely um definitely love this um i think this was 35.99 and i did get this in 18 um i've definitely like i'm definitely between like a 16 and 18 now whereas before i was more like a 14 and 16 um so yeah i got this in 18 and it just fits wonderful i'm just i just absolutely love it the next up is this jumpsuit and again i absolutely love it so as you can see i think it's meant to be like a bit cropped but it's kind of like it is a bit of a weird length on me but honestly i'm not really that fussed because it feels well i can't even explain to you how comfortable this actually feels it is just like this soft jersey material it's stretchy and um, it's just thin straps which is perfect for summertime um but that's just a pile of stuff there that i've got <laughs> that i'm trying on um but yeah it's just these thin straps and it is absolutely comfortable it is oh gosh i absolutely love it i i'm obsessed with it i think it's just so comfortable this is the 18 i've got in the 16 but you know what i'm not even gonna bother trying the 16 on i think this this just works for me this does work um it's just nice and flow because i feel like here in the middle it can kind of sometimes like very be very clingy but it's just like this is just so floaty oh gosh it is everything it's lovely i'm pretty sure this was like 25.99 which i think is just such a good price i mean so I'm obsessed with it honestly I feel like I would get so so much wear out of this I think it would just be my go-to you know if you're just popping out to the supermarket which I feel like I do quite often <laughs> I feel like even though I get my shopping sometimes I do end up popping out to the supermarket just for like little bits and bobs or whatever um yeah it's lovely it's lovely it's wide legged as well which is perfect yeah, I think I'm definitely going to be keeping this because it's absolutely stunning. Um, and like I said, I don't think I'll even try the 16 on because I doubt there'll be much difference anyway. And I just feel comfortable and confident in this as well. So, And another dress which is just absolutely stunning. So this one is just like a strapless dress. And then it's really stretchy at the top. And then it's just like a full length. And Little Miss Jayla is awake so if you can hear a little baby it's just a um but yeah so this is just like yeah full length dress like a, a max well i would say it's a maxi dress but i feel like it's not all the way down to the floor which obviously is perfect because you don't want people dragging on the floor but again look at the colour of this dress i am just absolutely obsessed with it oh my gosh i feel like it's near the core it's just everything i wanted it to be <laughs> everything i picked up just looks stunning um, and i'm pretty sure this was 35.99 as well um, and i did get this in a 16 because obviously it does have the stretchy top um which just makes it more comfortable so definitely a thumbs up for this one as well i think i just thought for quickness i just thought i'd just quickly check it on over the, over the dress but it's just an oversized t-shirt um i did get this in an 18 I don't think it's 15.99, but as you can see, it just says Paris 1993, and yeah, it's just a nice oversized t-shirt. Um, wear a cycle shorts, um, shorts, leggings, anything, um, and it's just really comfortable. I love the colour as well because it's navy blue, and yeah, I think it's just a nice top. It feels nice and soft as well. So again, I think I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this. Have you just woke up, Taylor? Yeah. Can you see yourself in the mirror? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Is that you in the camera? Look at your curly hair. <gasps> wow. Ooh. 
Mwah. Should I get your clothes out for the day? I'll give you some breakfast. Yeah. But yeah, I think she's set for about an hour. So that's her morning nap done for the day, isn't it? And we're going to get you some breakfast. And then we're going to go and see Nanny today. Aren't we, great Nanny? <coughs> Excuse you. Excuse you. I'm just back in the car because I've just gone to see my nan. Um, by the way, I am in the back because I basically sit in the back still with Jayla. Um, because I feel like she doesn't really like sitting by herself. Obviously, if I'm driving, then obviously no one can sit in the back of her. Um, but yeah, I usually sit in the back if it's just me um, and Jayla, and obviously if Jason's driving. Um, but we was going to go out to home bargains and b and um, so I'm not sure we might do that because I do really want to go, like I said earlier. Um, and there's also like an Aldi around here, so I might pop in there as well. Um, so I'll just see because I'm not sure what we're doing yet, whether we're just going to go back and chill or... <laughs> mm. Mm. So I'll show you what we get up to. So first we just popped into B&M and I was just looking at the homeware stuff. As I've said before, my vlogging skills are like not that great in public. I just get so nervous and I feel so awkward. Um, but it's something I'd really like to work on. Then we just popped into Home Bargains and I actually picked up these glass jars. I absolutely love them. I've been using them like every day. They are yeah, I don't know what it is, but your drink just tastes so much better when you use one of those. But yeah, they've got so much like, cute picnic bits in at the minute, like the ice cube mould and like the plates and the bowls. Like They're just so cute. So just thought I'd quickly show you them. And then we also picked up some lights as well for our outside, just in, for our back garden. Um, and that they're so far, they're actually quite nice as well. So really glad that we picked those up. Our little princess is asleep. Oh, she looks so cute. <laughs> we also just quickly popped into TK Maxx as well. I went in there just to look at the uh, baby clothing. And yeah, I absolutely love it in there. I feel like it's very hit and miss. Sometimes you find good things, sometimes you don't. But they do have some really cute, unusual clothing in there that you might not be able to pick up in like, stores. Um, and they also have like, designer clothing as well. And also, sorry about the camera angles. I know it's the wrong way. Um, you have to blame my cameraman for the angles. Back from B&M and Home Bargains, did grab a cheeky McDonald's as well. Um, obviously didn't get Jayla at McDonald's. She's eating her food now. Um, so if you can hear like that's just her eating in the background um, yeah so like I said went to b and went to Home Bargains I got a little bit of footage but I'm really rubbish at filming in public so it wasn't the best footage at all I mean it probably it's probably like a minute or less that I got in there um, but I'm just going to include it anyway I didn't actually pick up that much stuff um, so I'll just start with B&M first. Um, the first one I picked up was these. So I actually went looking for these in the B&M that's like close to me. And they didn't have them. And I actually went in there twice for them. I ended up just buying like normal like just jars. And they've worked absolutely fine. But I thought as I've seen them I might as well pick one up. Um, and there was only a pound. I actually saw someone on Instagram with these. So just say like oat yogurt and fruit and then you can just layer up your like obviously your oat yogurt and your fruit and then you can have it for like breakfast so i usually prep like two so i bought two jars and i've got this one but I, I usually just prep like two and then i'll have them and then i'll do another two um but yeah there's only a pound just think it's such a good price and then obviously the lady at the till, when I checked out, she was like, oh, I didn't realise we had them in because she's some on Facebook. There wasn't actually that many left, but yeah, I just thought I'd pick up one because obviously I've got the jars and they do exactly the same thing anyway. But yeah, how cute are that? And only a pound as well. I think that's a really good price for those. I picked up one. I picked up some mascaras because I actually use these just for like cleaning around the sides and like cleaning the oven and things because obviously they've got like the soft bit and then they've got the... Like, the like the hard bit at the, the end. So I use them just for like cleaning and I just like to keep them in the cupboard as well. And I just picked up a bottle of bleach and then I also picked up these Dettol wipes, but they're limited edition and they are peach splash. 
I've never actually seen these before, but they've got like a whole range in of like peach stuff. So I'm just gonna let me just have a little sniff, see what it smell like. Oh, they smell really nice. They smell lovely. So yeah, I'm excited to be using them. I really like when you buy like wipes that have like a nice scent to them because I feel like it makes the kitchen and wherever else you use them for. Makes them smell really nice. And then I just picked up a short because I forgot to get one in the shopping that we did this morning. And then just moving on to Home Bargains, um, I picked up these. Again, I watched a YouTube video and I saw these in one of the videos and I just thought how nice it was. So these are actually glass and they've got like the bamboo um, lid with like the straws. But like how cute are they? I'm obsessed with them. Um, I actually bought some strawberry gin from m and so I'm going to make one of those later in one of these. So I'm going to go and give them a quick wash and yeah, I'm excited to do that. I just picked up some like solar um, lights for outside. So we actually had, when we moved... <laughs> Is that nice? Yeah. Ooh, you're dropping it all on the floor. When we moved in, we actually had some lights up that the previous owners left. And there was like solar lights, but there was like fairy lights. And I don't know why, but they stopped working. <laughs> um, but we bought these just for the bottom of the garden. So I think these look quite cute because we've got like decking and then a bit of like got the grass, but we've got like a little bit of soil. Um, and then we've got like the shed. So this will fill the space in between. So hopefully they look really nice when the sun's out. But yeah, I think these are really inexpensive. There was like 79p which obviously is a very good price. So I thought I'd pick up four of those. And then I also picked this up for the garden as well, because um, in our back garden, jail has got like her own little play area. So like, you know, you go to like, the parks and things and they've got like the um, like the blue like flooring. I don't know what it's actually called, but it's like spongy. So she's actually got her own little section of that in the garden. It's got like a little gate round. Um, and I, I bought like a bunting for the outside and I bought a new bunting for inside of it as well. And yeah, I thought just, it'd be nice just to decorate it with a few little bits and bobs. So I picked this up because I think that would look quite cute. So I'm going to hang that up in her little play area. And these are really cheap. So I think it was like 59p or something. So I think if it looks cute, then I might end up getting a few more um, just so her play area looks really nice. And picked up these i actually don't like these but jason picked these up and they're like the new walkers crisps that are like these are like monster munch but they're like the just like the standard walkers crisps so got those so i forgot to mention from b and i actually picked up one of these as well because we've got like a very small just like the like it's like a microphone cloth. I've just I don't know if I've said that right, but yeah, it's like one of those little cloths with like the little bits that hang off, and it's really good. But for the top of the stairs, this is definitely needed just to get in like the like the gap. But I'm gonna go put them in, in the garden. I'm gonna go hang her um Jayla's little swirly twirly thing in the garden as well. Um and then I think yeah, we're just chilling for the rest of the day today. And obviously it's a Sunday, so Sunday's are always like a chill day. So yeah, we're just gonna chill and like I said, oh I'm gonna make a strawberry gin lace, which I'm really, really excited about. So I'm just gonna show you how I prep my breakfast and then I think that's it really. I think that's what I'm gonna leave where I'm gonna leave the vlog for the day. Well, the whole vlog. <laughs> I've actually enjoyed vlogging today. I think it's quite cool um to like vlog and like I don't know, I've just kind of you need to do things like in the day and then like you can kind of document what you do. <laughs> so yeah, I think it's quite cool. So a lot of people I watch, like they'll just be like, oh, I've got to do my washing or, you know, I'm like baking or I'm cleaning. Um, and I feel like a lot of people do actually do like cleaning videos. So I think I'm just going to start doing that. I think, you know what? I think you should do what, like, what you enjoy the most. So yeah, that is the plan so hopefully you've enjoyed this vlog but yeah Jayla's just gone down for another nap now um and that'll be her last one before obviously she has her um, dinner later and then she has a bath and then she'll 
um, go to sleep then. So yeah, this will be her last little nap. So I thought I'd quickly get this in while I can. Um, because she's been so bad of her teething. It's just awful, isn't it? Because I feel like they never stop teething. And obviously like when we have like toothache and things, it's quite painful, isn't it? So I couldn't imagine like a whole tooth coming through. Um, and a lot of times like her first bottom two are through. Um, and obviously they came through together, so it's like two teeth coming through at the same time. So, yeah, so I'll, I think I'll have to move the camera and put it forward just so you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so for my breakfast, I've got this jar, the one that I bought earlier, and then I've also got this jar. So these are jars that I've just been using um, already. These are £1.50 from B&M as well. So I'm just going to pour in just some um, granola. So I've just popped that in and this one's just um, honey and almond granola from Tesco. We're going to grab Greek yoghurt. So this is a, this is yoghurt that I use for it. I just bought a small pot because I feel like then I don't have loads of like wastage. Because sometimes the big pots I tend to like not eat it all sometimes. So I'll just use these. So I'll have to use two obviously. So I'll just spoon that in. If it's on top and even, hopefully you can see that there. <laughs> Bad camera angles. And then I'm just gonna chop up some strawberries. So as today I do buy the big strawberries because Jayla loves strawberries. They're like her favourite um, fruit, I'd say. So yeah, I just I just chop these up anyhow. I'm I'm not even like very like precise with them or anything. I just chop them up to how I feel to be honest that's probably how much I put in I don't go like overboard with it maybe I'll put one small one in but I don't tend to go like put loads in I just kind of keep it all kind of similar so pop those in that one's done and then obviously I'll move on to the next one and put those ones in so here. there we go that is prepped for the week like I said I'll do two of these and then I'll do and then I'll do another like when I get them then I'll do another two on that day I should feel like I'm not prepping my breakfast that far in advance because normally I just probably won't want to eat it after just cook our tea later and I think that's pretty much me done then for the day. I'm just going to chill out. Probably go and get pyjamas on, to be honest, because I literally just love wearing my pyjamas if I'm just chilling around the house. And, like, I know that I'm done for the day and I don't have anything else to do. Um, but yeah, I don't even know what we're having for tea tonight. I think I want to pass chicken pasta bake. The Jayla's meals as well. I made, like, a big spag bowl and then, like, I froze little pots of it because um, obviously I can't have like, added salt and sugar and things like that so I thought I'd make her one of her own and then I'm able to like freeze it and she can have it whenever she likes then but yeah like I said, I'm going to leave this here I really hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to thumbs up don't forget to subscribe for more videos and I'll see you all in my next one bye